I mean, I just made some shots and uh, made the shots that I normally make instead of missing the ones that I normally make. That's all I saw. 11 of 17 uh, tonight. How much was the efficiency, the, the lack of efficiency from you that you're accustomed to? Is that bugging you? The what? Lack of efficiency? From the last. I mean, like, for example, we played New York, I was 7 for 20. Like, I don't. I just missed the open shots and um, even the ones I tried to create, I just felt like I just let us down because I didn't make them. Um, and I feel like when I take them, I'm expected to make them. And um, yeah, so it's just frustrating when I shoot, you know, miss the shots that I, everybody's used to me making. Coach Malone said you have another level to go because of the thing you do with Mm-hmm. What does that look like? Defensively, um, just moving a little quicker. Um, without hesitation when I take, you know, playing through contact, um, being a little stronger in my stance and stuff like that. Um, fast breaks, you know, being aggressive, going to take off instead of, you know, looking to pass or deterring what I normally do. So, uh, just, I mean, there's there's a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, I can offer, I can score the ball, guys. Like, don't be surprised. <laughs> it's just, there's another, there's obviously, yeah, there's another level. Um, I'm getting to, and like I said, I don't know where I'm at, but you know, from Utah game and game one, you can see it's night and day. So I'm just gonna keep progressing, and you guys will see, uh, see the progress. It's a game, you guys. So basically, a quarter form for the, for the season. Um, how would you assess the first quarter of the season for you guys? I think we did a great job, um, especially on the road. I think that's where we made a big step, not just winning games, but but staying together in those moments that other teams make a run, and, and going in a hostile environment and executing plays and and on offense and defense. I think uh, that was big for us, having that, those early reps in those games, and uh, that will lead to later in the season when we need it. What are some of the biggest challenges for you when you're coming back from the health and safety program? What are the biggest ways you kind of feel that on the court? I mean, I didn't do anything for five days. Uh, I didn't leave my house, so uh, just conditioning. I didn't have a good feel for the boss, probably why I didn't shoot well. but. Um, yeah, it was just tough when I was coughing. I still had that. I still have some symptoms, but I didn't have the COVID. So um, yeah, it was just good to get that out of my system. And and now, obviously, you know, I'm not tired out there. My my, my wind is really coming back, um, and that's exciting. So once I can get off this minute restriction, I'll be good. I don't know. Okay. It's not enough. Though. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I had uh, 25 today. 25 minutes. Did they, uh, did they get you a Peloton when you were? No, they got me one during the COVID. So you still had it? No, I gave it back. I ain't really use it, so. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. <laughs> yeah, they, I got one too. I just gave it back. Said, you know, give it to give it to you over. Uh, fourth quarter, were you throwing candy? I always do. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, I'm not on it. Oh, well, get with the program, man. You're late. <laughs>